Hello friends, this video on understanding numbers part 2 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So here in this lesson, we will deal with larger numbers. We will see how do we write larger numbers in words? How do we decide which number is bigger and which number is smaller? So we will deal with all those things. So we will know all about numbers. Now, before we go ahead, let us first look at the number list. Now, from where does our number start? It normally, it naturally starts from one. So that's where we start counting numbers. Now, what do you see here? The number starts from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Then you have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 and so on. Finally, you reach a number called 99 beyond which you have three digits number. So gradually what you see as your number list keeps going, the number of digits in a number keeps increasing. So you start with a one digit number. Then you have two digit numbers then three, four, five, six, seven and so on. And then and this list is unending because there are infinite infinite number of numbers possible now what we observe is as the number of digits increases number as a whole becomes greater so if you compare any number like 1001 with 12 which one is greater 1001 because it has more number of digits now looking at this table we have a certain observations now if i ask you which is the largest two digit number what would you say the largest two digit number will definitely be 99 because after 99 you have a three digit number similarly if i ask you which is the largest five digit number so that would again be 99999 because after this you have the six digit number so this is the largest two digit number similarly which is the smallest three digit number that is nothing but 100 so this is the smallest three digit number now these are certain things that you get to observe when you have this number list in front of you on the screen and another interesting thing that we observe is all these numbers so many infinite numbers how are they created they have been created with these di digits 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 so these are the digits with the help of which these infinite numbers have been made so with these 10 digits we have made infinite numbers we have made uncountable numbers so that's again a beautiful thing do you know any number which has something other than these no you you think of any number they will have only these digits so it is basically a number is formed by different arrangements of digits so that's how we make numbers so now let us talk about making numbers how do we make numbers so number is nothing but arrangement of digits now when you interchange the order of digit you make new numbers let us look at few examples on the screen you see 25 now 25 is made up of two digits 2 and 5 so they together make 25 now what if i interchange the position of the digits that is if i place 2 here and 5 here what will i get I will get something like 52. Now, do you think that 25 and 52 are the same? Of course not. 52 is a greater number than 25. So, they are different numbers. Similarly, when you have a three digit number like this, 4, 5, 6. So, you have three different digits here which make this number. Now, the moment you interchange the position of the digits, for example, 4, 6, 4, sorry, 4, 6, 5. Or if you write 546, or if you write 654, or 645. Now look at any of these numbers, all of them contain these three digits that is 4, 5, and 6. It is just that their positions have been changed, and by changing the position, we are coming up with absolutely new numbers. And the same is true for all these numbers. But the, the only difference is that when we were dealing with smaller numbers like a two digit number, the only possibility was to 
change the interchange the position of these two digits but when you are dealing with bigger numbers there are more possibilities that can happen for example here you had so many possibilities now here you will have all the more number of possibilities because you have more number of digits so two can go here two can be placed here also two can also be placed here two can very well be placed here so you know you can play around with the digits because you have more number of places here so it is a five digit number so you have actually five places so they can get they can like interchange amongst themselves to form many different numbers so in this way we can actually make numbers in in fact this is the way how numbers are made thank you please visit examfear.com for free quality education you can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons you can ask your questions you can refer notes and you can take a free online test we have content for class 6 to 12 on physics chemistry mathematics and biology along with practical videos so please subscribe to our channel for daily updates thank you